all right guys so uh, this is the second last video of this course and we will discuss some mitigation of phishing emails that how you can mitigate those phishing emails so the first one is uh, any individual or or you are an analyst of any organization then just keep remember one thing that uh, whenever anybody is asking for your personal information never give right never give them uh, personal information even the even the even if there is any person who, who is a, a senior level and asking for the confidential uh, information uh, regarding something uh, then also you should not give without the permission of your uh, manager so this this is number one and number two point uh, definitely if any sender is coming uh, there will be some sender which uh, from which the mail is coming so this is your responsibility to check the display name and check the legitimacy of an email and check the domain of that particular that whether it's legitimate or not right and third one we have any files if you have any files, just uh, do not click uh, directly on the on that file and do not try to download those files uh, even uh, even they are looking for trustworthy at least uh, you should uh, check all the details whether that is uh, you can say that is uh, malicious or not so uh, we have already show you that how you can check in send boxes correct so number four we have uh, users should avoid clicking links right uh, like we have different types of hyperlinks maybe there will be some url shortener and may, maybe there is where there will be some links under the image that is uh, we can say the steganography uh, concept right so what is steganography so steganography is nothing but a uh, hiding of data in an image that is called steganography this technique is known as steganography so you should also check the uh, hash value of that image as well right so uh, yeah so we were talking about the url uh, url link so at least you should ch check that that whether it's a legitimate or not number fifth we have users should always be on lookout for any grammatical error and spelling mistakes so this the in this this one the number fifth one which is you are looking i can say 90 percent of analysts do a mistake here let's say it's a microsoft.com now i'm i'm telling microsoft.com there is just a one single uh, letter you can say a difference so that difference uh, you can you should have uh, have that much knowledge and you should check all all the things very clearly that whether it is microsoft or microsoft so check the spelling mistakes first right so it will help you very much six point we have it is important to take note of unusual information in the text of the message let's say in the in a, uh, which uh, one of the email which came and in that it is written that we will attack on you uh, on this day on this day something something so uh, just take those things seriously don't don't be light in that manner just uh, uh, tell just uh, discuss in that your team meetings and uh, even uh, even you if you are getting a individual mail then you you should also check your security as well whether you have antivirus or not uh, whether you have a different uh, your firewall is on or not uh, as per uh, if i talk about the perspective of organization then you should check each and everything of your security for in SOC uh, that whether is, there is something vulnerable or not seventh point we have identify and educate potential spear phishing targets so we should also uh, educate uh, the person uh, right and we uh, we should have that much knowledge to identify its spear phishing target and uh, mark those persons that who are a very senior leader and keep keep them aside keep them in a different thing so that you can get to know each and every emails what they are getting eighth one use the proper email and web filters that is one very important and ninth one is make dmark as your friend so dmark we have already uh, discussed in the previous uh, in the last one i guess right so in the under dmark there is dkim and spf right so these are the things uh, which which you can uh, uh, take 
uh, to mitigate of phishing emails. I hope I'm very clear with that. Uh, bye bye. Take care.